Hello guys, hello guys, I am motivated to do this video now. Get done and dusted, let's get this video done and dusted. I will do a video about the some other topics in boxing, Tyson Fury, Alec Joshua, some of negotiation, <laughs> blah de blah blah, um, I saw a lot of different things in boxing. I, I'm going to do a video before, um, sometime tomorrow, but uh, with the Tyson Fury, Alec Joshua, me, all the topics as well. This, this, this week has been well, just a whirlwind of different boxing events with the Crawford, Spence announcement. Oh, all sorts of things going on. Anyways, I start. This is, the video is about the weekend prediction. We I start with the main, in my in my opinion, the most interesting fight. Not the most exciting fight. I think the most interesting fight is Conlon, it's Lopez. The most competitive. But the most exciting fight, Lara Ward. So I'll start the big news of in this fight. This fight won't be for the world title because unfortunately, Lara is weight limit up by four or five pounds. So only, only what's his name can win it. Lee Wood can win the, the title. So Lara stripped of the title from what I understand. So I guess he's either if he was either Wood with the title, or the fight, or he gets or, or um. It has to be a rematch, or I don't know. Or allow us to fight like, again, fight somebody else for the title again, but only for the title for Lee would have went because of the missed the weight limit for, for the way in Lava did. In my opinion, repeat revenge for this fight. If Lava does it, I think it'll late stoppage. I think it'll swim away the fault. Uh, Lee was more technical fight, he won the early rounds, but then he would just let his guy go, might get tired, and, and I think possibly Lara will clip into it, or in the late round between round 7 to round 10. Can we leave Wood beat him? Yes, but I think he's struggling, he's, he's getting up in age, he's 34, 35, so 1, 2 fights, and 3 fights max Wood has. But it's going to be an exciting fight to fight, regardless. Um. Akoli, Billy Smith. Akoli wins this. I think by points. He will come back to fight. But uh, Billy Smith is one of the best cruiserweights this country has. Although not obviously not as not, um, skillful as, as Akoli. And there's other powers of Akoli, but definitely. He always brings to fight. He always brings his A game to a fight. But I think Coley beats him, but, but on by points. Yeah, nice decision. Good fight to watch. So I can't wait. Um, another fight, Lopez, um, Conlon. This is the most competitive fight at the three title fights tomorrow. My gut feeling is Conlon by split decision. Decision, split decision. Lopez has box perfectly. He will stop Conlon by per perfectly because this is going to be. He would totally be fired from the beaten point because this Conlon's is in Belfast, so Conlon's backyard. Well, I can't wait to mock. To, to, this is the best boxing weekend in a long, long time. I think it's history in the making. Never been a, a weekend where there's been three title fights in Britain. Three different title fights, all competitive matches. It's all, all really good, but, but you know. Oh, we can fight this last this week, last weekend. This weekend was the best boxing weekend ever in any boxing history. Um, kind of wait. Let's well, come on, subscribe. Get subscribers up, man. Just trying to get to four hundred subscribers by five hundred subscribers by the end of the summer. Let's do it, guys. Adios, amigos.